This book written by Jory John and illustrations by Pete Oswald. Jory John is a New York Times best-selling author and two-time E.B. White Read Aloud honor recipient. Pete Oswald is a painter, illustrator, and filmmaker. My son chose this book personally. We buy it a pack of two with a good egg book for $8.5 in a scholastic website. The Bad Seed is a story of a seed that are so bad. His both manner and hygiene, enough to make people around him stay away and talk behind his back. He still can hear them though. Some examples given are very contextual, happen in everyday life. Even my sons also relate. The plot twist in this book was that there's always a backstory of everything. Why the seed become very bad? He was a happy seed in the beginning, like any seeds out there with the warmth of his family at their home. But then something came up, incident that make him separated from family and lost everything he has. He's alone and traumatic. He lose all his hope, happiness, only bitterness he felt inside. And on that moment, he become a whole new seed. A very bad seed. Then, he decided to change. At least he tried to be better. Sometimes he still do all the bad stuff, but sometimes he also do all the good one too. People still talk, but some can see what he is now. He's not that bad anymore. My son loved this book, asked so many questions, and after so many reread and question, he concluded that we cannot label anyone. There is always a reason for everything. People can change, and everything has a process. And everyone has his own story when none of us has the right to judge. This book gave a great lessons not only to children but also for adult to be reminded. The picture is cute. The storyline is super simple, though it carry a huge lesson for the reader. I really recommend this book for parents who want to teach the children self awareness and social awareness. Thank you for watching this video. Please press like button and subscribe if you like this review.